Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Technology and today in this video tutorial, I will show you guys how to optimize your Windows 11 for gaming. So I will show you guys step by step. So you just need to follow me. So before change any settings, I will create a restore point on my Windows 11. You can also create a restore point. If you will create a restore point, it will help you to back up your old settings. So whenever you need to back up your old setting, you can easily uh, use your last restore point to back up all your old settings. To back up your old settings, you just need to go to your start menu and you just need to type restore point and after that, you just need to click on create and after that, you just need to type the restore point name and after that, simply click on create option. So the number one is game mode which is help you to optimize your PC while you are playing games on your Windows 11. Also it will help you to turn off the background apps while you are playing games on your Windows 11 PC or laptop. To enable game mode on your Windows 11 you just need to right click on your start menu and after that click on settings. Now click on gaming from your left side. Now on your right side you will get game mode. Simply enable that option. Number two is Storage Sense, which is help you to automatically free up your drive space like temporary files or recycle bin files. To enable that option, simply you just need to right click on your start menu and go to settings and after that click on system. Then here you will get a Storage Sense which you have to enable. And you can also select after how many days your file will be automatically delete from your computer. The next one is best performance settings on your Windows 11. For that you just need to go to your settings. Simply right click on your start menu and click on settings. Now you just need to click on system from your left side. On your right side you just need to scroll down a little bit and you will get an option called about. So click on that option. Now under our device specification you will get advanced system settings. So click on that option and now here you will get a new window which is system properties. Now what you have to do you just need to click on advanced option and under performance tab you will get a settings option. Now here on this window you can see adjust for best perform performance option so simply select that option after that click on apply then ok. And after that click on ok once again and then you are done. The next one is select maximum number of processor and memory for that you just need to go to your start menu and type msconfig after type that command you can press enter or else you can click on that system configuration option after that here you, here you will get a boot option under system configuration and click on advanced option now check that option which is number of processor now select drop down option and here you just need to select the maximum number of processor in my case it is 32 and check maximum memory once it will done you just need to uh, click on ok and then click on apply ok after that you just need to restart your pc number five is delete prefetch if you need to free up small amount of space on your system then you can delete this prefetch file to delete prefetch file, simply you just need to go to your start menu and type uh, run and after that open run box or else you can press windows plus r button together from your keyboard. After open run box, you just need to type the command is called prefetch. Now press enter or click on this ok button after type prefetch command. Now delete each and every folder under pfetch folder. So I'll select by pressing Ctrl A and after that zip delete all the files and folder. 
Number six is set Nvidia for best performance. For that, you just need to right click on your desktop and click on show more option. And after that, click on Nvidia control panel. After open Nvidia control panel, you just need to click on the left side corner adjust image settings. Now on your right side, you will get an option called use my preferences option. So select that option and after that, drag this one to performance. After that, you just need to, after set performance, you just need to uh, select apply button. After that, close this window and restart your PC. The next one is disable startup apps on your Windows 11. For that, you just need to uh, go to your uh, your start menu and type task MGR. Also, you can right click on your start menu icon and click on task manager. So simply right click also and click on task manager through this way you can also open. Now click on our uh, startup apps from your left side. On your right side you will get all your apps so you just need to simply one by one you have to click all the apps which you don't want on your startup so just right click and click on disable so i'll disable next cam also idm after that close this window and you are done The next one is update your GPU driver means graphics card driver. For that you just need to go to your browser and search on Google. You just need to type on Google NVIDIA uh, drivers download. After that press enter. Now go to that uh, first link which is NVIDIA downloads. And after get this page you just need to type your means you have to select your product so in my case it is g4 and 30 series and my graphic card is 3070 ti i'll select that option now select the operating operating system in my case it is windows 11 now download the game ready driver and after that click on search then click you have to click on our uh, download button and after download you just need to install that new gpu driver to your computer The next one is delete temp file means temporary files. For that you just need to go to your start or search window and simply you just need to type percentage temp percentage okay. So just type percentage temp percentage. So don't worry about that I will give you that command on my description. After that press enter. Now you will get that uh, temp folder window so you just need to simply select all the files and folders under temp folder. You just need to press Ctrl plus A to select all the folder and file and folder and after that uh, just delete all those file and folders. The next one is uninstall unnecessary apps on your Windows 11. For that you just need to right click on your start menu and click on settings. After open settings window you just need to click on apps. On your right side you will get a installed apps option so click on that. Now here on this window you will get all your apps which you have installed on your Windows 11 PC. So find those apps which is not required or you are not using. So you just need to delete those apps which you are not using on your PC. So simply just need to find that apps. In my case it is messenger so I will click on that three dot button. And after that you just need to click on uninstall. Now click on OK and you are done. The next one is this cleanup tool. For that you just need to go to your start menu and type clean MGR. Okay. After type that command you just need to press enter. Now you have to select your uh, C drive where you have installed your program files. Now click on OK. Now from this window you have to select temporary files and which is not required temporary files and recycle bin files you just need to select check that option and after that click on ok button to delete or clear that file from your hard drive
the next one is defragment and optimize your drive for that you just need to go to your start or search window and type defragment and optimize drives after that click on defragment and optimize drive now here you just need to select your uh, C drive where, where you have installed your program files and after that click on that optimize option and you are done also I have made a video on how to fix Windows 11 lagging and slow problem so you can check out on my channel or else I will give you on my the link on my video description so you can check out from there so I hope this video tutorial will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any questions or questions then comments down below I will see you guys in the next one next video Till then, bye-bye. Take care.